Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Kagan. It's Randy. Uh, what I'm going to show you how to do today is how to adjust your fast feed clippers. Also, fast feed. These are the black fast fast feeds, um, but this is it's the same as the burgundy ones. Uh, so, what you want to do first? I'm gonna show you exactly when you buy Austin fast feeds. When you close them up all the way, all the way, you see a big gap, and you want to make it as close as you can. And that's all the way open. But as you can see, you can still, when I close it, there's still a lot of space. So what you want to do is you want to have your brush. You want to have a brush. You also want to have a screwdriver. Screwdriver. I'm going to unscrew this part. I'm, I'm actually going to unscrew everything on the top part. All right. Make sure you, when you when you fix your clippers, you always want to have a towel or do it on a flat surface just so you won't lose pieces, right? So now that part is off, right? That part is off. I'm going to unscrew the lever, the lever part. I'm going to unscrew that part, right? Completely take it out. And when I unscrew it, there's going to be about three pieces in there that you make sure that you do not, you do not lose, okay? You want to take it out carefully. Pay attention. I want to take it out really carefully because, like I said, there's three pieces. There's three pieces under there, and you need that part, right? So I'm, what I'm going to do. This part is really important, also, in the fast feed clipper. This piece right here, this little piece. This is the, the reason why your fast feeds uh, are, are silent. All right, I'm just gonna clean it off for, for my clippers, for John's clippers. I'm just gonna clean it off, clean it off, right? Make sure you, everything's nice and clean. I'm gonna take this whole piece off, right? Take this whole silver piece off. Right, oh. I was looking for this piece. I was looking for this bronze piece. This bronze piece, you don't want to lose this piece neither. Okay? So I'm gonna clean all that off. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna actually unplug these clippers before I get electric. <laughs> right? So with that being said, just make sure you clean everything off so you can work with the clean environment. Everything's all good. You're gonna place the bronze piece back in. You're gonna place the bronze piece back in there, right? And then you're gonna then put this piece, slide it right back in. But when you slide it in this time, alright, I'm just gonna shut up. Snug. And so, with the lever, if you can see, there's a circle. There's a circle right there. Can you focus on that? Is it focused? There's a circle right there. When you close it, when you close it, to make it closer, you want to have that screw at the lowest that it can get. So now, the original one, it's, it's perfectly in the middle. That's the original way. But what we want to do is we want to have it all the way to the top part of the circle that's inside, right? And so that's where it's supposed to be, right? Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put, I'm going to go ahead and put the screw back in. I'm going to put it with the whole lever included, right? Get my screwdriver again. Close that bad boy up. He's not coming from that middle of the hole. And with that, with the with the fast feet so close, the blade should also be closer. And you can stop it on there. Alright, so let's make sure that it works. Close open, close open, right? I'm gonna hook
hook these clippers up. Just brush it off real clear. How, how long is it? 505. All right, cool. So just clean all that off. All right. Yeah, for you guys that are following me on Instagram, can you guys see? Oh, man. What the hell happened to you, bro? Oh, man. <laughs> what happened, uh, bro? So, for you guys that follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and you see my my fast feed get so close, right, this is what I Good. this is what I do. All right. right. So man, remember, you have this piece is really important. Trust me. For you barbers, when I was young, I took that piece out because I thought it wasn't needed. My fast feet were always loud, and then I figured out that's the reason why. Slap that piece back on. You can also purchase those little pieces from certain people or online, right? So I'm just gonna, oh, actually I'm gonna close it. It's the closest it can get right there. Right? I'm gonna mash up my fast feeds. Mash it up. With, the, with also the, lo the, the lowest that you can get right there, right? I'm just gonna put this screw in there for a little bit. I'm not gonna screw it in all the way. Cause I'm gonna go left, right, left, right, cause I don't want the blade to be messed up. Right? Let's see. Get a magazine or like a hardcover book. And as you screw it in, <laughs> That's one word you don't ever want to hear is oops. Right. Alright, you know, we'll get it. Turn around. I'm just gonna press down on it. So you too, it's Kagan, it's Randy. Uh, what I'm gonna show you how to do today is how to adjust your fast feed clippers. Also fast feed, these are the black fast fast feeds. Um, but this is, is the same as the burgundy ones. Uh, so what you wanna do first, I'm gonna show you exactly. When you buy also fast feeds, when you close them up all the way, all the way, you see a big gap and you wanna make it as close as you can. And that's all the way open. But as you can see, you can still, when I close it, there's still a lot of space. So what you wanna do, is you want to have your brush, you want to have a brush, you also want to have a screwdriver, screwdriver. I'm going to unscrew this part, 